Sashrikal ji. So in this video, we are going to share the information about some uh, courses and institutes or universities in which uh, you can uh, at at undergraduate level uh, you can apply and which are eligible for spouse open work permit. Okay. So I think I have shared the same detail on our Instagram account also. And if you have, if you are not following our account, don't forget to follow that. The link is mentioned in the description below. And the list which we are going to share with you guys in this video now is also going to be mentioned in the description below. So if you are in a hurry, you can check the list below. Okay. So uh, first program is a Bachelor of Engineering, uh, NBE Basics, and there are some selected programs which are eligible for spouse open work permit. And this program is in, available in twelve universities. Uh, which are which are uh, Lakehead University, Memorial University of Newfoundland, Ontario Tech University, uh, Carleton University, York University, uh, University of Saskatchewan, University of New Brunswick, uh, University of Windsor, Cape Breton University, and University of Manitoba, University of Regina, and University of Ottawa. Okay, the next program is uh, Bachelor's of Education. Okay. And this is available in six universities, which is University of New Brunswick, uh, University of Regina, Brock University, Vancouver Island University, uh, Mount Royal University, and University of Lethenburg. Okay. And uh, another program which is available in which is in which if you apply eligible, which is eligible for open spouse open work permit, is Bachelor of Science in Nursing. Which is in which is available in Laurent University, University of Saskatchewan, uh, Toronto Metropolitan University, uh, McEwen University, Lakehead University, and Mount Royal University. Okay. Yes, there are many other courses, uh, very in similar programs, which are also available in other universities. Also, you know, the, the list up here is available in other also. These are few which we are dealing in. And uh, if you are, if you want to apply along with your spouse so these are some programs in which you can apply which can which in which your spouse can accompany you so if you want to apply or if you have you know made your mind then drop me a mail our email id is mentioned in the description below okay and uh, we will try to post more videos related to uh, courses uh, which are high in demand actually they've already started a small playlist i think the previous subscribers who have already subscribed to this channel are aware about it uh, i have posted one small video but in coming future few days i will be posting more videos with higher job demand programs and the reason i'm telling you guys is because is that that please try to focus on those programs the whole fuss about not getting job or you know the immigration policies being changed and uh, all the things happening i think you're completely aware about it but i think i think that if you are applying keeping the courses which are high in job demand uh, there is a very good probability that the stricken policies or any strict uh, immigration changes won't affect you that much moreover though particular programs are <clears throat> in demand so it's quite obvious they will have a good demand, job demand in India also. So in case if uh, later on you decided to come back, you will have good opportunities in India or other places in the world, right? So try to keep, try to you know keep in mind these few factors while selecting a program, okay? And uh, if you like this video, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much for watching this video. Keep supporting. Bye-bye.